All right, guys, so check it out. So 2003 Ford Focus and the idler, the idler pulley went bad. So the bearing was still good. But what happened was they sell, this had five grooves in it, like a belt, like that. So somebody in the past, they, this is the same number. See that 6203RS? Look at 6203RS. So this is for the, for the tensioner arm, and this is for the idler arm, but they come, they, they're the same number in the computer. So if you don't watch out, they'll give you this, which has grooves in it. And the grooves are on the back side, so the belt's supposed to run, the belt on this is supposed to run like that. Um, and it, they act like it runs like that, but it doesn't. It runs on the flat side of the belt, so you should have a flat side steel like that. And this is the right one. But uh, anyway, and what it started doing, as you see it, this is the outside of the belt. It started cutting grooves into it. That's the inside of the belt, you can see. And it started cutting grooves, and that's crazy. So, just completely deformed us, chopped all the chopped all the verticals out of it. You know the V grooves, and then the belt slid inside, and then that was all she wrote. So, whoever put the idler pulley on um, should have got the metal one. I put it all back together. And then realized the mistake running the belt, so I went, took it all back apart, jacked the motor up, and wound up getting, because you got to jack the motor up to get this pulley out. And uh, luckily, it's all the same hardware, but uh, that's the number right there. And then that's the number right there. You can see it's the uh, same number. It's crazy, man. 6203RS. And if you don't do this, you have a problem. You have a problem, and that's why the that's why the belt broke. So I wound up getting the belt. I had to replace the belt. This is a brand new belt, man. But look at the conditions. I can't put it back on there. You know, it's got grooves cut into it. But that was the problem. That's why everything kept failing. And I had already spoke about there was a pulley problem. So I just didn't know what it was. And here's what it is. Which, anyways, we're gonna put it back together and see if I can make it work. In that's uh, what I got to say about that. But you got to check and make sure your parts are right. And I think that this probably has been like that for a while, and they just keep putting belts on it. So hopefully this will make the belt last, you know, which I'm sure it will. So that's where we're at, man. Um, talk to you later.